these things always begin with an idea and it arises inside people's heads. I want to get to know these people and I want to experience the development of the Sauber C34 first hand, up close and in person. I mean, the, the, the start setup is 3.75 on the front and 1.5 on the rear, so me, this one is I'm more happy to start, to start like that. We could even start with the 1.25 and just deal that one. My closest connection within the team is the one with my new racing engineer. One of the most important tasks of the winter is getting to know Eric so that we understand each other completely. So basically this is what you started off with in test 7. So you see that especially shifting from first to second. Yeah, and this is basically the impact energy that you get after an upshift. That goes for the personal level as well as the technical aspects. So it's important to me that we can joke around together. Good. So you're, you're getting the 10 while we are working our ass off. Yeah, that's how it should be. <laughs> yeah, true actually. That's the tough life of a Formula One driver. Summery temperatures in January. Regardless of appearances, this is not a holiday. It's a job. Thailand is a great country. It's uh, always good weather, and I don't have much to complain about. It. That was even better. But to be sure, the first weeks of the year are all about hard work. Before the season starts, getting into shape is crucial. It's a perfect place to do the preseason training because Europe at this time of the year, especially Sweden, it's really, really cold and dark and it's always, it's really difficult to get uh, four or five hours of training, uh, you know, each day. During the season, with all the traveling involved, the best you can do is try to keep in shape. If you don't build up endurance now, you won't make it through to the season finale in Abu Dhabi. We focus mainly on uh, cardiovascular training, so that includes everything from running, from bicycle, and to stationary stuff in the gym. Come on. Discipline is good, monitoring is better. Alex plays a very special role during this phase. Devising training sessions with enough variety is the key to keep up the intensity. The interplay between physio and driver is a key test. We're becoming really good friends, but at the same time, you need to try and stop that sometimes so that he's always doing what I ask him to do. Of course, sometimes you're going to be like, get out of here, <laughs> you know? It's a thin line, you know, like to, you don't have to get too close, but still close that I know him and to feel how he's feeling. I'm sure he's quite busy <laughs> all the time. Now my fitness is just on another level compared to before. And you need to be fit. If you're fit in the end of a race when everyone is tired and you're a bit more fit than the other guys, that's going to make a difference. The ideas the engineers come up with wind up here in the rapid prototyping machines. They can produce anything in no time. Prototypes made of resin are not as expensive as carbon. The prototypes are integrated into the model, and here they are. 